one on a car guy one on a car guy.com and what I got for here for you today besides bunches of cars for sale it's just a random walk around work vlog type video which reminds me I haven't even done the video for today yet that's gonna be for sale nice car I just got everything fixed up and going in that and I have this nice Magnum for sale I actually got the Fiat going bye bye and guy that was over here working didn't even know how to put a block under something correctly and broke two blocks I don't care about the broken block what I care about is I had to tell him dude change those out man they're broken oh did it break them so very nice RT Magnum I've been enjoying driving it around as much as I can enjoy driving it around um, it's a good car runs good drives good and right now I've got to get that little Fiat out to be done with it One car down, two to go. Now, I'm hoping actually that the Fiat has a key in it. This I 30, very nice car. If you're looking for a cheap little gas sipping, good running, I don't know, car for your wife, car for your kid, car for you. This is a cheap car that's actually a luxury car. This is it, man. Cold AC. Sunroof, moonroof, all the options. One owner, I believe. Um, one or two, I gotta check. I think it's one owner. In fact, I'm almost positive. Beautiful car, full review on my channel. And it's, I've actually got family I might be selling it to, which would be nice, because I like the car for anybody, especially family. Okay. So I'm just making a random work vlog. How tight of a turning radius does it have? Not tight enough to do this. Okay. So I'm just gonna get these out. One more. We'll leave this running this out and this is a interesting setup I got here if these two cars weren't here to be easier we've actually got a Mercedes in the driveway so you think about it, I've got five cars here it's five parking spots it's awesome it's definitely a plus for me and I've got a good deal worked out to compensate to have these five spots and I can get stuff shipped so much cheaper by driving it up here How much battery is there? 82, 62, 82%. Okay. This good little car. I, I enjoyed driving this car. I'm trying to think if I need anything from the store. <laughs> I'd like to drive it to the store one last time. Yeah, I want to. I'm gonna pull this out. What am I gonna do here? Leave it in the middle of the street? I guess I could. How about I just take it over here? I talked to the guy this morning and ranted and raved about his new car, about how cool it was for a while. And it is cool. I dig the car. Okay. Man, it's hot. I wasn't ready to be doing this right at this time. I was sitting in the shade. It's not cool in the shade, I mean in the sun. 
Beautiful man. It makes me want to take a picture and put it on Facebook and try and sell it. But at the same time, I want to wait and get it cleaned up and get the correct pictures. Nice little Infinity. It's a good car. I really dig the car. And I never had the little small body Infinity. Ice cold AC. What made me buy this car? What made me buy this car was I kept seeing them with like 250, 325,000 miles on them. And I was like, damn. It's just a Maxima. Gotta be pretty cheap to work on, too. Looked up some parts. I always do an eBay check. If you're looking to own something, look at what an alternator is going to cost. Look at what a starter is going to cost. Look at what a couple things are going to cost for it. And you should be a lot happier in the end. Okay. I'm actually going to take off and go to the store. I want to drive this car before it goes. This will be my last run in an electric car. Lizard. Good thing the dogs ain't out here. Roxy, what are you doing? Yeah, buddy, V10 2500. Only 90,000 miles on a V10 Dodge. Okay, I've got this guy coming to pick up the Fiat. I need to go to the store, get a few things. I'm gonna find out exactly where he is, because I ain't gonna just wait here for him. It's not the way this works. It's doing work like that. I don't like that. Did I really? Think about that somehow. This thing got locked. Oh, I left the keys in it. This will make it turn around in a thing. Wow. Peppy little car, it's fun to drive. Fun little car, man. I will be getting another one. You can almost guarantee it. I guess it depends on if I get a good enough deal, huh? Because that's what I buy, is deals. What kind of a vlog am I making now? This is just what's happening today, okay? It's just what's going on. My office has been calling me on my other phone. I don't know why, and I've left it at the other place, so. Woo, buddy, you're like a little go-kart. You just gotta hold on. Well, I took this thing all the way to Walmart. That's all there is to say about it. Now, one thing cool about electric cars is this. Just depends on where, but this particular Walmart has electrical car parking, buddy. Never used this one. So I don't know a lot about it. I'm just gonna plug the damn thing in. That's a bigger one than I have. Well, that doesn't sound good. That's the one I have. That is not the one I have. Wow. I think this will be the one. Let us see. That's me.
waiting for payment. This one wants payment. If you've got the full kind, these do not require payment. Connect to vehicle and start. Now it goes by RFID. Well, no free charging for me, but free parking. And Walmart. What do I gotta buy? Stuff. Fix the Mercedes, gotta get some antifreeze. Actually, antifreeze is like three, four dollars a gallon here, cheaper than frickin' O'Reilly. So, that's just the cool stuff. Well, I got my last ride in my Fiat. Good little car. It's a fun little car. I like it. I like driving it because you zippy. Vegan right now, by our man. It just, boom. The hell is this idiot doing? One owner car guy, oneownercarguy.com, and what I got here for you today is a car getting picked up for transport video. That's it. Just my car is getting picked up for transport in the middle of my day while I'm doing things. I don't know what time it is, like 2.15 or something maybe, 2.25, 2.35, about 2.15, 2.17 really. This car is a blast to drive. It's a 15 Fiat 500E, 100% electric, which is very cool. Um, this here transporter has been here for about 45 minutes and he actually pulled up about five minutes after we left Well, I left. I ain't got nobody with me. Got a frog in my pocket But yeah, so he pulled up five ten minutes after I left Called the office. He was here and right at the same time She's calling to tell him I wasn't gonna be here for 45 to an hour. Now it's 52 minutes later. and Here I am so I I'm on time with what I say, but I don't wait around for these transporters. I'm I'm, I'm Far done waiting around for him. Screw him. There he is. There he is. Cool plates. Oops. How are you doing? So far, so good. Well, for yeah, he was talking about tomorrow or something. And I said, man, we can do it today if you wanted, because he's saying you wanted to come today. And I'm like, no problem. We leave it tomorrow morning, that's what it is. You're leaving from, oh, you're taking it to a big truck? Yeah. Oh, gotcha. I don't need this. You don't need this stuff? Are you sure? <laughs> you can leave it here. Just leave it here. <laughs> Come to the car. I told the guy when he bought this, I told him, he called me up this morning. I said, man, I said, the days of getting a free full tank of gas with your car are long over, but I'll take care of you on this one. You'll have most of a tank. It sure is cheap to drive. I'd never driven one before and I really enjoyed it. A hundred percent electric. I loved it. I really was impressed. But cool. Yeah, if you, uh, you got an inspector or whatever, I'll sign and you're so now do you that already to come with the Tom Toms, you know? Yeah, they they have the it has the Fiat logo on it. It's really cool. I never used the Tom Tom much, but I wanted to. I don't get to keep nothing. <laughs> I gotta sell all this stuff. But I want another one of these. A cheap little car. You know what? You'd think it was light, but it ain't light. It nice it's almost as much as a Camaro. Yeah. Which surprised me. It's battery. Yeah, the battery's what weighs everything. That's what it is. People think it's small. It's light. It's small, but it ain't light. <laughs> Is that? Yes. 
that. We'll put this in a box. I'll definitely be buying another one. And I wouldn't have thought I would have said that when I bought it. Why you said that? That's what I do. I sell cars. For what now? Huh? Yeah. Should have paid more? Yeah. Why? Oh, 600 is what they're paying to transport it? Yeah. Well, that is cheap. It is cheap. All the way to Florida? Yeah. I don't mind, you know, Orlando or some other place, but Naples. It's a long ways, huh? Way down. He set it up. I've never dealt with you guys before. Make sure I get your card so I can deal with you guys. You guys are good. She's like dealing with you and everything. What is the date? Like fifth. Fourth or fifth? Oh, come on, man. It's got to be the sixth or the seventh. Today? I think so. The fifth. No. We're betting? Five dollars. Five dollars? Yeah. Or one drink. One drink. Okay, you're on. One drink versus one dollar. Okay. okay. Seventh. You're kidding. You owe me a dollar. Man. <laughs> I wasn't sure, though. Okay, there you go. Do I look funny for a Samantha? I do, huh? <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Okay, keys. Are they in it? Oh, here you go. Only one keys, right? Yeah. So now you're taking it to a big rig? Yeah. And you run around with a U-Haul trailer all the time, just pulling them into the oh, shop, or? It depends on. I was in, a, uh, what is it, Lake Huge. Uh-huh. Man, it's winding, 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 top of the mountains. And i glad I decided to do that. Do it like that yeah. way. And look at the map. It's kind of risky. And then he said, oh, all the same, I chose to come in here, <laughs> sir. <laughs> <laughs> with then many cars? No, I don't think so. <laughs> Okay. Thank you very much. Well, thank you, sir. Have fun. All right. Hey, Roxy.